When you putt, are you putting to the back of the ball or are you putting to the bottom of the arc? There's a major difference in both of them and one is going to help you make more putts more often. The other one is going to just frustrate you to no end. And in today's video, I'm going to not only tell you the difference between the two, I'm going to show you which one is better for you and why. Putting to the back of the ball versus putting to the bottom of the arc has a huge difference and a huge impact on your ability to start the ball online and the path of the putter to be square to that line. Now, putting to the back of the ball would refer to, if you have the ball forward, which most people will have a tendency to play in their putting stroke, would be squaring your upper body, which you have a natural tendency to want to square your chin or your nose or the center of your clavicle over top of the ball. That would be setting up to the back of the ball. And you'll notice I don't look like I'm very balanced in that position. What happens to the putting stroke is, as you set up to the ball, you have a tendency to get your shoulders square and your head square, but now you can see that my shoulders are slightly open to the ball and or my arms are gonna get slightly open. And then my putter will have a tendency to go out to in too much. Better players, because they have a better understanding of the relationship between where the head is and where their uh, the putter head and where their head is, will get the putter head back in here, which means they're going to drag it too far to the inside, which will lead to pushes and or trying to close the face by rolling it. Neither of them are going to help you make putts very consistently. Setting up to the bottom of the arc, let me first explain, bottom of the arc is going to be right at the center of your stance under the assumption whether your feet are roughly shoulder width apart or whether you prefer to take a very wide stance it's always going to be at the center of the stance identified by the orange stick so setting up to the bottom of the arc is where you keep your tip of your nose your chin and the center of your collarbone would be straight over the middle of that stance you do not have to, to play the ball position there because due to the arc that you swing on, which for the average human being, you swing on a, approximately a four and a half foot radius, which means that from the bottom point of your stroke up to three inches to the target side of that, the putter face will be bottomed out to the ground and the face will be square to the intended target line, unless you do something with the hands or the arms to modify that. But it will give you a much, much higher chance and percentage to get the ball started on the correct line. So instead of setting up to where you're square to the back of the ball, as such, I want you to start to set up to where you're square to the bottom of the arc, i.e. the center of your stance. And then you can play the ball anywhere from the back of the ball at the center up to three inches forward of that. And so long as you're set up correctly, you can make a good perfectly square stroke, start your ball online, make more putts more often and have a hell of a lot more fun in the process. Hey everybody, thank you for watching another one of our videos. If you found this useful and used it in your game, don't forget to click that like button and let us know down in the comments below. Also, don't forget to check out our podcast, one of the hottest podcasts in golf, Golf 360. If you'd like to watch another one of our videos or subscribe to our channel, you can do so right over here.